Hello, literature lovers. Today, we are going to take a comprehensive look at one of the cornerstones of modern literature, Sylvia Plath's novel, The Bell Jar. This video will take you on a literary and personal journey that will help you understand Plath's struggles, the depths of the novel, and why this work is so fascinating. If you're ready, let's step into Sylvia Plath's world. Part one, the basics of the book. The Bell Jar holds an important place in the world of literature as Sylvia Plath's only novel. First published in 1963, this work is considered an autobiographical novel that bears traces of Plath's personal experiences and spiritual struggles. Author, Sylvia Plath Publication, Date, 1963. Genre, Autobiographical Novel. Publisher, Heinemann, First Publisher, later reprinted by many different publishers. Original title, The Bell Jar. Originally published as The Bell Jar, later updated to The Bell Jar, a novel. The Bell Jar centers on the life of Esther Greenwood, a young woman. Esther is presented as a successful student and magazine assistant idealized by society. However, as she struggles with career goals and social pressures, she experiences an internal breakdown. During an internship in New York, Esther encounters conflicts between societal expectations and personal ideals. A series of incidents and personal failures disrupt her mental health, and she eventually falls into a severe depression. The novel describes in detail how Esther overcomes this difficult period and her stance against social norms. Chapter 3. Character Analysis Esther Greenwood Esther Greenwood, the main character of the novel, is a young woman struggling with the effects of social pressures and personal failures. She starts out as an intelligent, talented, and conforming personality who conforms to societal expectations, but she feels as if she is trapped in a closed glass box. Esther's psychological state is the most important element at the center of the novel. Mrs. Greenwood, Esther's mother is the representative of traditional female roles and social expectations. The mother-daughter relationship deepens Esther's inner conflicts and social pressures. Mrs. Greenwood's traditional perspectives are an obstacle in Esther's struggle to find her own identity. Buddy Willard. Esther's lover, Buddy, represents certain norms of society. Buddy's attitudes and role in society have a significant impact on Esther's individual struggle. Buddy's behavior makes Esther's conflict with societal expectations even more apparent. Section 4. Themes and Symbols, Mental Illness Esther's depression and psychological problems are one of the main themes of the novel. Plath elaborates on the individual and social effects of mental illness. The inner emptiness and hopelessness Esther experiences gives readers an in-depth look at mental health. Social Expectations Esther's struggle with societal roles and expectations of womanhood is an important theme of the book. Plath explores the pressures faced by women of the time and the effects of social norms on the individual. The Bell Jar. It is the title and an important symbol of the book. The glass box symbolizes Esther's feeling trapped and imprisoned. This symbol represents Esther's mental state and social pressures throughout the novel. Chapter 5. Sylvia Plath's Literary Style Sylvia Plath's literary style is characterized by interior monologues and detailed psychological descriptions. In her unique style, Plath describes the inner worlds and emotional states of her characters in depth. The Bell Jar is one of the best examples of this literary style. Inner Monologues Through Esther's inner monologues, Plath explores her mental state and psychological conflicts in depth. This technique helps readers to better understand Esther's thought processes and emotional state, symbolism, and metaphors. Plath uses various symbols and metaphors in her novel to express Esther's experiences and inner world. The symbol of the glass box is one of the most powerful examples of this symbolism. Personal experiences. The bell jar reflects Plath's own mental distress and social pressures. Plath's personal experiences strengthen the autobiographical aspect of the novel and offer readers a more intimate experience. Chapter 6. Social and Cultural Impact of the Book 
The Bell Jar had a great impact at the time of its publication. The book is notable as a work that questions the social roles of women and deals openly with mental illness. Feminist Movements The book is considered an important work by feminist movements. Esther's stance against social expectations and her personal struggle are considered as a text that questions the social roles of women. Psychological Literature The Bell Jar occupies an important place among psychological novels. The book deepens the literary representation of mental illness and is considered an important source in psychological literature. Cultural Impact Plath's novel contributed to the acceptance of women writers and psychological-themed works in the literary world. It is also a reflection of 20th century American culture and social changes. Sylvia Plath's The Bell Jar is a masterpiece that has left a deep mark on the literary world. The book offers an important perspective on mental health, social pressures, and individual identity. Plath's intimate portrayal of her inner struggles and social criticism offers a different experience for every reader.